Hi everyone, I'm Kathy and welcome to my kitchen. My cauliflower casserole dish is just wonderful. It's a substitute for us for the mashed potatoes. I will cut the cauliflower up and put it in a pot and boil and let that cook. After it's finished, I'll drain it and I'll mash the cauliflower along with a cup of heavy whipping cream, a stick of butter, a half a cup of Bisquick mix, I have a quarter teaspoon of nutmeg, a quarter teaspoon of white pepper, and a half teaspoon of sea salt. And then I'm going to use some Parmesan cheese. So in the mixture, I'm going to take a cup of Parmesan cheese and mix it in with the cauliflower. And then after I put it in the casserole dish, I'm going to spread the top with the rest of the um, about a half a cup of Parmesan cheese and put it in the oven and bake it at 350 for about 20 minutes and it is so yummy. Nice side dish. We're going to have it tonight with our meatloaf and we just love it. So let's get cooking. Now that the cauliflower is all cooked, I've drained the water out and now we're going to mash it. So you take a masher and you mash the cauliflower. And after you get it mashed up, then I'm going to put in a half a stick of butter. And a half a cup of heavy cream. One egg. And continue to mash this up. going to take the seasoning which was a quarter teaspoon of nutmeg, a half a teaspoon of salt, and a quarter teaspoon of white pepper and pour it in and mix that up. Now your cauliflower is going to be a little chunky, not too much, it's fine. And now I'll take the Bisquick mix and mix it in with the cauliflower. Stir that around. Towser, you need to leave the kitchen. Your heavy breathing is on my video. I have a package of shredded Parmesan cheese. It's one and a half cups. And I'm going to put in a cup. So leave a little bit for the topping. And stir in the Parmesan cheese with the cauliflower. I have a two quart casserole dish that I prepped with some spray oil and I'm going to just pour the cauliflower mixture right into this casserole dish. And then I'm going to spread this evenly and then take the rest of the Parmesan cheese and sprinkle on top. Just sprinkle it all around. If you have someone in your family who doesn't like cauliflower, this will change their mind. Just make this dish and they won't even know it's cauliflower. Okay, we're going to pop this into the oven for 20 minutes and it will be done. And here is my wonderful cheesy, cheesy, cheesy cauliflower casserole. I hope you like this recipe and I hope you try it and let me know how it turns out for you. And please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe down below and click on that bell so that you don't miss next week's fabulous recipe. Cheers! Okay hubby, dinner time!